Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we re diving into a topic that gets a lot of questions. Understanding how proxy sites work and what they reused for. You might have heard terms like bolt proxy links or seen people wondering how to make a proxy website, especially in a school setting. We're going to break it all down in a clear and simple way. Now you might hear people talking about specific proxy lists, like Bolt Proxy Links 2026. What they re usually referring to are lists of publicly available proxy servers. These lists get updated all the time because servers go up and down. While these can be useful, it's important to be careful. Public proxies can sometimes be slow, unreliable, and might not be secure. Always be mindful of the information you share when using a public proxy. However, a quick heads up. If you're thinking about this for a school network, remember to always follow the rules. School networks have restrictions for a reason, often to keep students safe and focused. Using a proxy to get around these rules could lead to trouble. It is always best to use the internet responsibly and respect the policies your school has in place. The knowledge of how proxies work is great to have, but using it wisely is even more important. I hope this helped clear things up. If you found this video informative, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Tech Deep Divies. Got any questions? Drop them in the comments below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.